Thank you. From Silicon Valley Clean Energy at the November meeting, the Silicon Valley Clean Energy Board of Directors announced the appointment of its new CEO, Monica Padilla, who currently serves as the agency's um, chief operating officer <clears throat> and director of power resources. She will assume the role on April 1st, 2024, after current CEO Garish Balachandran retires at the end of March. Padilla's selection was approved unanimously by the SBCE board. Padilla will lead the dynamic agency in advancing decarbonization programs and policies and continue collaborating with the SVCE board and communities to achieve our shared vision. The SVCE board of directors approved a 15-year power purchase agreement with Pattern Energy for a new wind project located in New Mexico. The new construction wind project will provide SVCE 100 megawatts of renewable electricity, helping SVCE to achieve its goal of reaching 75% renewable portfolio standards by 2030. This is the 20th long-term power purchase agreement that, is signed by the, that the agency has signed, representing over 900 megawatts of clean power, 1,800 megawatt hours of battery storage, and a total of $3.6 billion invested in clean power projects. The Board of Directors approved implementation of the net bill tariff, more commonly known as NEM 3.0, which is the new billing structure ordered by the California Public Utilities Commission for new solar customers who installed systems after April 15, 2023. All new solar customers will have the NBT rate structure implemented via PG&E starting in December. SVCE will collect and analyze customer performance data during the course of 2024 to suggest potential modifications to the SVCE generation portion in 2025. SVCE is launching two new programs to support member agencies in local decarbonization. Using $4 million previously allocated by the Board of Directors, SVCE will meet member agencies where they, are, where they are to evaluate permit improvement and policy opportunities that could reduce barriers for residents and businesses going electric. Through the 3 million permit modernization and 1 million policy experimental programs, SVC will meet with each agency to evaluate opportunities that make sense in their community and develop a tailored action plan. Member jurisdictions will also be able to receive the technical, legal, and staff resources Needed to, per, needed to support the implementation of the plan. And lastly, SVCE member agencies have taken impactful actions by passing new construction reach codes and have the power, power to encourage and incentivize decarbonization through additional policy. These programs are available to all 13 SVC communities. Three communities will have the opportunity to receive even more support than their plans by joining the leadership cohort. Thank you.